everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome to my channel so today's video i've got a super super exciting one so i am in fact working with love honey and today i will be unboxing their new advent calendar so as you can imagine love honey stocks lingerie they stock costumes but they also stock a lot of toys <laughs> So Love Honey have in fact brought out an advent calendar with 24 doors that leads to 24 days of fun, if you're asking me. So today's video, I will be unboxing all 24 days so you guys can see what Love Honey have put in their advent calendar this year. And if you are interested in purchasing one of these advent calendars yourself, I'll leave it linked down below. You know what's insane is that this advent calendar is worth around £450, but you can get this for £150, which is insane to me and i'm sure you'll get a lot of fun out of this advent calendar so yeah i feel like we should just dive straight in and unbox it oh my god i'm so so excited for this so i'm gonna dive in to box number one which is just up here so let's see what's inside of it okay so what i can see straight away is there's a little cable so it looks like it comes with a charger you know me i love when a toy comes with chargers literally it saves so much money on batteries i spend so much money on batteries so it is one of those so behind door number one is in fact this little bullet and you know what what a great way to start off these 24 days i feel like these come in so handy you know when like you don't want to make a lot of noise but you also want to have that same amount of pleasure and they're so easy to just carry around with you as well and they're so easy to hide i remember when i lived with my parents starting to experiment with toys and sort of understanding myself in like a sexual manner was very very difficult especially when like my mom would like tie my room and you know go through my drawers sometimes like to put things away like it is really difficult to hide so i feel like these bullets are great so yeah this is behind door number one i also love that it comes with a charger as well i feel like that gets bonus points okay so now going in with door number two which is right here i'm gonna go in and open it i'm so so excited for this i think it started off really, really well with like the bullet for number one that's a great starter toy you know oh wait what is this? You know what? I feel like my mind is going to be open so much with this advent calendar. Because normally when I'm shopping for toys, I kind of stick to the same sort of stuff. I feel like with this advent calendar, it's going to make me branch out massively. And you know what? I might even find like a new thing that that's like my new favorite thing, you know? Wait, I actually don't know what this is. Is this like... Wait. Wait, is this... Maybe it's like something for a guy. The first thing I'm thinking is is like is this a flashlight? I'm thinking it's a flashlight, but I'm not 100% sure so I am googling it very very quickly. It is! Okay, there we go. I knew it was something like that. See, I guessed and I was correct. So this is in fact for the guys. If you guys are into sort of, you know, self-pleasure, which 100% I'm such like a advocate for i feel like knowing what you like yourself will definitely bring you know extra sauce into a couple sort of sexual relationship so this is in fact a flashlight so of course i'm definitely gonna have to you know wait until i have a partner <laughs> to bring this out for sure but until then i'll keep it wrapped up i'll keep it safe and you know what the next guy that i bring into my love life they'll appreciate this <laughs> Okay, now let's dig into number three, which I can see is down here. Let's dig in. <gasps> oh, stop it. Wait, is this what I think it is? I think it's restraints. Wait, I think they're leg restraints or like handcuffs. They're either for your ankles or for your hands. I'm not sure, but I think they probably can be used for both. I love restraints. <laughs> Try not to go TMI, but I am a fan of restraints and I feel like they're kind of like a must for me. You know, they are kind of like a must. So yeah, that's what's behind door number three. Okay, now going in to door number four, which is down here. Let's dive straight in. Okay, what is this? Okay, so it is a pleasure bar. Is this like lube, but like, will it like tingle? It's like pleasure balm i've never tried balm before i've only ever really tried lube lube's really really good even if like you don't need lube per se i feel like it's just it adds that stimulation it adds that sort of like sensation i'm really really excited to try some balm i feel like that'd be really really interesting to use especially because i've never used it before okay let's dive in to door number five door number five is in fact here so let's open it together guys Guys, <laughs> just from opening the door itself. Okay, so this is the next thing. <laughs> this is, is, in fact, the next thing. And it is, in fact, a 
little dildo, which I think is very, very good. So correct me if I am wrong, but I do believe that the bullet can fit inside of the dildo. 1010, if I do say so myself. Yes, yeah, so this is the next item. This is from door number five. So if you can wait five days, this will be worth it. Trust me. Okay, oh my God, I can't believe we've already gotten to door number six. But it is, in fact, here, just below door number one. So let's dive straight in. So inside door number six is, in fact, a little ring. I'm not going to say the full term because I feel like YouTube will hate me forever. But this is a little ring that obviously goes over a male genitalia. And again, I will be waiting until I have that special person in my life to bring that out, of course. Okay, so now on to my lucky number seven. It is just here. So two doors below number six. Let's get this open. Okay, I see you. I see you, love honey. So behind door number seven is a very, very trusty and a very, very big essential to, you know, intimacy. I feel is a blindfold. I feel like everyone has a blindfold or everyone needs a blindfold. Blindfolds are literally... They enhance the experience for me personally because it's like, it's not knowing what comes next. You know, like you can't see, you put all your trust into the other person and I feel like a blindfold brings so much excitement into the bedroom. So yes, the next one, door number seven is in fact a blindfold. Okay, now moving on to door number eight is this little bitty one right here. So let's get it open. <laughs> door number eight is an interesting one. It seems to me to be a little starter item for people who want to experiment in that certain area and it is in fact a little plug. So this little plug is in fact got a little jewel on which is so cute and it's a little purple one which is literally one of my favourite colours. I feel like these ones are very much like a starter item. I've definitely seen bigger ones but again me personally i'm not massively into that sort of side of things not going to lie but i know it's a massive massive thing i know a lot of people who love it so i feel like this is a perfect item to include in the advent calendar of course so yeah this is this is the next item okay so now moving on to door number nine let's try and figure it out okay where is it it is here okay so behind door number nine is in fact a scented candle okay i wasn't expecting that but you know what as someone who loves having her home smell very very lovely a scented candle is always the perfect surprise gift love it it's literally the best thing ever i can't tell what it smells of i am coming down with a cold though so that's probably why <laughs> So door number nine is in fact a little scented candle. Can't believe we're only nine doors down. There's still another, okay, I can't maths, but like there's still quite a few more. <laughs> Going into door number 10, which is right up here, right next to door number one. Let's get this bad boy open. <laughs> okay, I've wanted one of these for a very, very long time. So I'm very, very excited to try it out. Not going to lie. It is a mini version. Also, again, it comes with the wire, which I think that's like, it's sort of done it for me. I feel like little things, you know, it's the little things in life. So the next thing that is in this advent calendar is I think by far one of my favorite ones so far and it is in fact a little wand and when I say it's a little wand it's an itty bitty wand but you know what I have wanted one of these for the longest time like I've just never invested I always go into like the stores have a little look at the wand and I'm like oh that would be really really nice like one day I will get it and I feel like that one day has come and now I officially own a little wand I feel like this is gonna be amazing I can't wait to try it out I'm definitely gonna put this on charge as soon as I finish this video and Again, with how small this is, this can be very, very discreet. So I feel like, again, this is another essential. Oh my God, I love it. I actually can't wait to use this. TMI, I'm, if you don't hear from me for the rest of the day, you know what I'm gonna be doing. <laughs> so now we're on to door number 11 and it is in fact over here. So let's get this open. Oh, 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 you can tell by my reaction. I'm like, ooh, okay. And I believe, these are, in fact, clamps to go on your nipples. They also have little bells on, or little balls, just to add that bit of extra weight, you know? So, personally, I've never actually tried these. I feel like I need to try them out at one point, you know? I do need to try them out, but I feel like pain for me. Pain. I'm not really a massive sucker for pain when it comes to that sort of thing. But I know for some people, it is a massive turn on. So, if that is something that you are into amazing 10 10 for you <laughs> okay so now moving on to number 12 which i can see is in this corner here okay let's get this open so behind number 
number 12 is in fact massage oil i've never received a massage which will be really nice one day i might have to try and find someone who would do me a massage but yeah so this is the next thing and it is in fact i'm assuming it smells of like vanilla because that's what the flavor is but i'm assuming you don't eat it again nose is blocked <laughs> But yeah, it's the massage oil in vanilla behind door number 12. Okay, so door number 13, let's go. Okay, door number 13 is quite big, so I'm a bit nervous about what's behind it. So it's just down here below door number five. Ooh, okay, this is meant to be good. I've heard good things about this. So this is what's behind door number 13, and it is, in fact, what is it? Like a, a, a stimulator for your, you know, like, the outside and then also from for the inside it massages both <laughs> it's like two jobs in one love it 10 10 and again with this as you can see it's got a little hole here perfect for your vibrator <laughs> if it is something that you like to have stimulated during foreplay during sex anything like that then this is one for you especially like solo play as well this doesn't even need to be like a couple thing 100% be solo play which ugh, solo play just hits different you know having that sort of relationship with your own body is so important i'm excited to try this i'm also a bit nervous as well like i've seen these around quite a lot but i've just never tried them out like i'm not really a, an experimental sort of gal when it comes to toys but i feel like with this advent calendar it will definitely push me out of my comfort zone and i'm so so here for it so yeah this is the next thing so door number 14 is just in this corner here oh what is this it's like a mat like a gel what is this i actually know what this is i feel like i need to google it again okay yeah no i i don't actually know what is behind number 14 but i'm assuming one of you guys will do so if you guys know what this is please let me know because i'm intrigued so it is in fact this gel pipe pad and i don't know what this is so if you anyone knows in the comments what this is then i'll give you kisses <laughs> i actually don't know but it's like ribbed and it has loads of little like balls on so i'm very interested to see what this is okay so that was what was behind number 14 okay so now moving on to door number 15 which is just here right at the bottom let's dive straight in see what this is okay so oh wait no it says on the doors what they are oh my god it says on the doors what they are there's me googling every single one like i don't know what this is and it literally says on the doors what they are oh my god i'm such an idiot i'm such an idiot well there you go guys so if you if you are confused about what any of them are or what they are used for or what they're meant to stimulate it says on the doors so you're welcome so that is in fact a textured stroker which to be fair is what i googled but like i couldn't find the exact item that i was holding it's for male males um playtime you know males solo playtime oh and then this this what i talked about earlier behind door number two is a rib stroker so it can be used for males or females you just put your bullet in it and then you can use it that makes so much sense okay so we're back on track <laughs> you know what i'm gonna blame the fact that i don't have my glasses on okay Shh. <laughs> okay so let's continue where we were at so we're at door number 15 and these are in fact ankle restraints so i believe the last restraint that i showed you were for your hands and these are for your ankles so now there's got like it's got all four you know it's got all fours that's even better you're gonna be like a starfish which i love that okay so now moving on to door number 16 so from what i can see in door number 16 are in fact dice i've never owned dice before on one dice it's got loads of different positions and on the other dice it's got the time of how long you need to be doing it for and again there's different minutes for each one so you've got 10 minutes 15 got two got one got a question mark so it depends how long you can last in that position this would be really really interesting that sounds fun that sounds really exciting actually you might even see some positions on this dice that you've never actually tried so it could be worth like you know experimenting we love that we love discovering new things during sex i feel like it's so important okay so that was what was behind door number 16 so let's move on to door number 17 and straight away this door is by far the biggest door i've opened so far as you can see this is what door number 17 looks like oh okay so this is in fact a body massage so i think it goes very well with the massage oil i showed you previously so this is what the massager looks like and i can imagine it feels really nice on your back with that oil oh my god 
Sorry, I had a minute. <laughs> so yes, that is what's behind door number 17. Okay, so the next door we have to open is door number 18. And it's just up here in this top corner. Okay, this is an interesting one. This is a very, very interesting one. The next one is in fact beads. Yeah, I mean, I've personally never tried anything like this. But it seems to be quite like a, a good warmer. You know, like a good like introduction to that sort of stuff. You also have to be really, really careful when you do want to explore that side of things. Make sure you lube. Make sure you don't just go straight in. You need to warm yourself up first. And I feel like this is a very, very good warmer upper sort of toy to experiment with. And as you can see, starts with a little itty bitty one at the top and then it gets bigger and bigger so yeah a really really good introduction toy to that sort of area if you are interested in that so now moving on to door number 19 it is in fact this one a really, really long slim one actually on this side so i'm really intrigued by what's behind this door so again i personally never tried anything like this so this is in fact a mini flogger so this is what it looks like i love the cute little design the little stars so as you can see this is a flogger <laughs> when you got the blindfold on you like tied down with the restraints you know dragging this along the body will literally just get you so excited like you just won't be able to bear it so yeah this is what's behind door number 19 okay so now moving on to door 20 we are nearing the end though which is insane i dread to think how long this video is so number 20 is in fact a little door up here so let's get this open i already actually own a couple of these and it is in fact a little finger vibrator sleeve so this itself isn't the vibrator it's just a sleeve for a vibrator to go in but thank god because door number one they gave you a little bullet vibrator so you just slide this in here and it's a little sleeve for you to use i think it's so good how they've given you a vibrator in door number one and then you can use this throughout all the multiple doors afterwards i think it's really really clever so yeah this is just the sleeve so that is what's behind door number 20 okay so now moving on to door number 21 gets a little bit bigger again so this is the door here so let's see what's in it oh okay so this is a sex position snap card game from sexual aerobics to classic positions with a twist this pack of cards holds the key to sexual discovery which i'm all for you know what discover what you like sexually and discover new things i think it's great okay okay this is kind of cool so all these cards in here have so many positions on so you you can definitely discover something new i feel like i haven't done half of these and it's like a little game of snap as well so i guess if you both pull out the same card you're doing it you know you're doing it so now moving on to door number 22 okay this is a big one this is a big door so i'm very very excited about what's behind here so it is in fact this door right to the bottom as you can see it is absolutely huge so i cannot wait to get this open so previously in this video i showed you a few restraints these are in fact the ties for the restraints which i sort of i guess these were gonna come but like i just didn't know you know i just did, i weren't sure so these are in fact the restraints that go under your bed and then you use the other restraints for all fours <laughs> of course you get tied down and you know dot 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 <laughs> i need a new pair of these i actually broke the last ones not gonna tell you how but i broke them um so i definitely need a new pair so these will really come in handy so yeah that's what was behind door number 22 okay moving on to door number 23 we are so close to the end now i actually don't want it to end though not gonna lie door number 23 is just this door right here so let's get this open oh my god i can't believe we're near the end this is insane so this is in fact a couple's ring for you know you can kind of guess i don't need to explain it so this is again in fact compatible with the vibrator so you could just put that in there and you get stimulation for both the male and the female which i think is so important i mean i've personally never tried it but i i'm obviously gonna try it now aren't i i feel like i'm gonna have to <laughs> so yes that is what was behind door number 23 and now we are finally on to the last door which is door number 24 so let's get this open i'm actually a bit nervous i'm a bit nervous this is the last door of this video oh <gasps> Okay, I think this product alone is worth the whole the whole thing. And again, you guys know what I'm like with my chargers. As soon as something comes with a charger, it's instantly like my top. <laughs> my top thing. So it does come with a little charger again. And then the final product that is in this 
advent calendar is in fact a womanizer classic to clitoral stimulation and this is what this is oh my god so i've heard so many good things about this and as well because this is so like insane it actually comes with a little leaflet on how to use it yeah toys are so much fun but you have to look after yourself you have to make sure you are using things right we don't want any infections we don't want any injuries I believe it's like a suction air thing for your clitoris <laughs> so i feel like this will be a very very interesting toy to use i've seen so many good things about a toy like this from all like from everyone every like sex positive content creator that i've seen they all love this toy and i'm so so excited to try it out for myself literally after i finish the film in this video i'm gonna be charging everything everything i have got right in front of me and i'm gonna be trying it out not gonna lie so yeah what a perfect way to finish off love honey's 24 days of advent really i think it's great i think i'm so so excited to try it out so yes that was the unboxing video for you guys honestly thank you so much love honey for working with me again i really really do appreciate it i love your advent calendar you guys have smashed it this year if you did enjoy this video make sure you give it a massive like down below as it will help me out a lot and as well make sure you are subscribed to my channel so you don't miss another video in the future you know can't miss any videos let me know down below what your favorite product is in this advent calendar as well what is one product that you'd love to try? And yes, I'll see you guys next time on another video. Mwah. Bye, everyone. <laughs>